guys, Zar here back with you very, very quickly looking for another buy opportunity right here above the high of the day. If we get a high of the session, stop will be below. This is my prior trade, by the way, the video beside this one. You can watch that one. And I'll be going for one hour. I'm going to delete this prior trade so we can keep this nice and clean. And I'll explain this one in more detail. We have an inside day here, guys, in the daily, but a bullish body flipping higher, looking for a wick fill on the daily. And we've got a little bit of room here to work with. In fact, quite a bit, almost this entire profit target that you see here, if in fact I'm uh, brought into this trade. And it looks like I'm going to be right about now. And there it is, guys. I am long the NASDAQ. Bear with me for one moment. Just going over to my own platform. I could have gotten a little bit earlier on this one. I like this little zigzag pullback tagging the 21, which to me is a fairly important thing. And the nine squeezing into the 21, breaking back above, could have entered here. And that would have um, you know, been halfway to the target already. But I wanted to make sure that the buying was serious here, not just some kind of a fake out move or a fake breakout and then dropping back into this fresh range, which may happen still here, guys, but this is just a little extra confirmation that I look for using a stop to enter so that the market actually has to be bringing me into the move in order for me to participate in the trade. And now it's the waiting game, patience. News in about 30 seconds, we'll see how this plays out. My suspicion is we're gonna hit targets pretty quickly here on this. Let me actually give the target so that the market knows where to go. Obviously, I'm being a little bit facetious here. All right, guys, moving my stop to break even now. And sure enough, guys, we are struggling to get through this key zone here, right? We actually ran into it and surpassed it and then sold off through it. And there was an argument there to take some profit off it, or if not take all of it at this key zone. Why is this a key zone? Well, it doesn't come from the UK session here today or the Asian session overnight. It comes from yesterday in the New York session. Of course, we are now in the New York session. The same participants are back here in the game and whatever they did here, they're likely to do more of here in the same session, right? And so there was a very strong rally that was completely and utterly stopped and diverted down, right? <laughs> reversed and rejected down and that's powerful market tried to rally again and at the same level was rejected down and that's precisely on the micro frame here what's happening is this little push down right a little profit taking so to speak or some extra selling coming in but there may be on this new day enough juice to get us to the promised land And there it is, guys. Nice, easy trade, trend continuation. I think I've explained this one in detail, but there we go. Breaking yesterday's high. That was a test initially, and then finally a break of yesterday's high. The yesterday's high is that stuff right there that I showed you and why it's so critical to get through that and why we hesitated, of course, as well. We see this happen over and over again. It's a pretty, con uh, pretty consistent pattern. I may have top ticked that exit. <laughs> we'll see how it plays out. Two trades, guys, probably done for the day at 10.07, 37 minutes into the session here, and I am likely done for the entire day. Pretty nice when we can do that, right? Nice and clean. Have an amazing day, guys. Appreciate you being here. Thanks for clicking the like button and saying hi in the comments. We'll talk soon. Oh,